Hey guys, how's it going? The Hagger Nerd here, playing some Astroneer. And uh, last episode, we got hooked up with a nice handy dandy truck and a trailer. And I think this is going to be enough for us to go exploring. Um, so you know what? This episode is going to be about exploration. We're going to go out and try to find what we can find and maybe find some more research. Maybe find some more... I don't know. I, I don't know enough about the game to say what we can find, but we are going to find it. <laughs> I will say that uh, at the very end of the last episode, I was panning around and I did see this thing up on the hill here. So that is absolutely going to be my first expedition. So we're going to go see what this is, deal with it, and then uh, see what else we can find. Let's go do that. Alright. Don't want to be uh, killed by the physics Cthulhu or something. Yeah, take it easy. It's like driving on ice. Ooh, more resin. I kind of want to get it, but I'm more wanting to explore. I know it's here. I know it's here. Ooh, I see some research. Sweet. Oh, this is glorious. Can I just pop it up here? Yeah. Okay. What is that? Oh, goodness. No power. No power. But I mean, I'm connected to the truck, right? This is a big solar panel, it looks like, but I don't know if I can dig it out. I don't think I can. Oh, that's kind of annoying. Alright, um... It's a little faster. It probably wouldn't hurt to put at least a generator on this thing at some point. Hmm. This is kind of slow going. What I want to be able to do is just run back and forth really fast, charge up, come back, get back to work. Run out, charge up again. Oh, this thing is huge. <laughs> I want to put that on my truck. Hey devs, why can't I put that on my truck? And the proper response to that would be because reasons. Infallible logic. Oh wait, this is fun. Okay, as long as I'm tethered. Okay, yeah, that, that works. I'm good with that. That's what was happening when I was running over here. I would lose my tether. Okay, what is up here? I like how that thing's surrounded by plants. I want to dig it up. What's up here? Is this compound? I do believe it is. Oh, my power issue is driving me nuts. Oop, careful, careful. Okay, we are done there. Ooh, lots more compound over here. 
Oh, oxygen. That is a thing that I need. Ooh, and I also need not to break my legs. <laughs> You know, I, I don't know if this is actually required because it seems like it's giving me oxygen from the truck itself. If that's the case, that is fantastic. That way I don't have to worry about managing my O2 as much and I'll just have to worry more about getting caught up in these rocks. <laughs> I see a cave up there. You know, I've mentioned Minecraft a few times. Um, you know, some of you guys watch this may have played it, may not have played it. This takes everything that was wonderful about Minecraft. I'm not, you know, Minecraft is its own game. Uh, but like, just the calm, almost zen, kind of like zoning out of being able to dig stuff up and gather resources and just kind of, you know, be productive. It's, uh, it's definitely present in this game. And, you know, I mean, you can compare this to Minecraft in the same way. I mean, I don't even know what I'm saying. It, 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 you can dig stuff up and you can gather resources. I mean, it's similar in that respect. And pretty much only in that respect. I mean, there's there's crafting, but the crafting system is completely different. There's no recipes. It's just you provide materials. All right, so we have two unknown researches ready to go. And yes, it does seem like my truck provides me with oxygen. That is great. I kind of want to dig around this thing. I, I get the feeling that uh, all this grass here is trying to tell me something. Could be wrong. I'm starting to think I was wrong. You know what they say about making assumptions, huh? Something about butts. Yeah, I think that's how it goes. Ooh, lots of compound here. This expedition has become very successful. Controls are still a little wonky. It's getting dark. Oh. There's some copper too. Let's put it there. Sounds like there's some more of those spitter plants. Oh. That's where the splitter spitter plants are. Okay, he's dead. So much compound, okay. Gotta watch out for these spitter plants. Hurry up. There you are. You did. You did. I'm almost dead. Don't, no, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Okay. All right, how am I doing? Um. If I pop that on there, I could probably grab one of those researches from the spitter plants, assuming it has it. Yep, right there. Hmm. 
I'm gonna have to get rid of some of this organic. And we're gonna get down there. Yep, that's that's a problem. Can I stick it anywhere else? I mean, I don't really need organics right now. What I do need is unknown research. Actually, what I need is a way to get down here without putting myself in danger. Uh oh. I know that sound. Oh, I hope my stuff's gonna be safe. Okay, I need to get down here. Hopefully, I have enough oxygen to keep me alive for a little bit. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, this is intense. <laughs> I don't see any blocks rolling around just yet. We maybe just be catching the corner of it. And I'm about to poke my head out and get smacked in the face with a big old block. Okay. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Yep, we're okay. Alright, good. Alright, let's uh let's all take all this research back to the base and see what we get. Oh, this is this is so fantastic, guys. Oh, man. I mean, a couple episodes ago, we were scrounging around for aluminum. I mean, we're still scrounging around for stuff, but... Like, I hate doing things step by step by step. Like, now that we can kind of compound all these different things into, like, one step, we can condense multiple steps down into one, it's, it's much more efficient this way. Efficiency. I enjoy efficiency. I enjoy being productive, getting things done, and not falling down holes that I almost didn't see. <laughs> um, um, still have, yeah, okay. Okay, we have to figure out how to do this. Okay, let's, um,. Ooh, hi. This thing's so wonky. Okay. Let's just, uh... Yeah, I'm good with this. It's got its own charging area. So let's pick this up. Because that's what we're gonna do. And like I said last time, we're gonna make another storage thing. You know, I, I almost feel like I could get away with one more trailer. <laughs> you know it's gonna happen. But it's gonna happen. Oh. Okay, so so that's definitely a thing. Um if the developers ever happen to get around to this, there's there's an issue where my camera just likes to spin around for no reason. So, bear with me guys, that's that's not something I'm doing, it just kind of happens. Not too pleased with it, but love the game. Alright, copper. Copper, copper. Hmm. 
We actually need some more uh, storage here at the base too. Well, that's building. We can go ahead and grab this guy. That over there. Okay, pull that out. Put this here. There we go. Ooh, more research. Sweet. Crane. Ooh, okay. I've never heard of a crane before in this game. Well, I'm sure there's a lot that I've never heard before in this game. That's that's interesting. A crane. What could I use a crane for? I mean, obviously picking things up. Hmm. What is that? Hydrazine. Fuel. Fuel's good. For, you know, when we need fuel. Which we haven't quite gotten to yet. Put that there. Plenty good. Alright, all kinds of... Compound there. I almost forgot the word for it. It might be getting a little late too, but I am I am still feeling good. I'm enjoying this. I'm having fun. Hopefully you guys are too. Put the beacon back on something here. <clears throat> Gotta remember to take drinks of water every so often. I get so sucked into the game and, you know, talking to you guys and just kind of talking about the game as we go. And I forget to drink drinks of water, and my voice gets all crackly. Okay. Let's see. Let's do that. Get rid of the copper for now. I think there is one more open space down here. All right. So, I need four compounds. And I already have two. Did I mention how much I love the GUI in this game or the lack thereof? Like, I can see everything I have right here. Oh, it's so good. Everything's, like, in the world. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, the, I guess you can consider that last one. Hmm. See, see, here's the thing. Is that considered extra storage? Is that something I actually have? Am I actually carrying four or five? That's the only thing I'm having issues with. I guess we'll find out. So now we have four up there. That's very strange. Okay. Okay, so I guess it is kind of like an extra bit of storage. Hmm. Okay, that's cool. All right, let's get us another rover. Oh yeah. And I'm going to do this. Oh, what are you doing? Is there some sort of weird something where once another rover is created, the old one decides to jump around and move? Okay, so I'm going to take this over here and drive this rover to the end of the other one instead of the other way around. Because I get the feeling that's going to cause me some troubles. If I try to do it the other way. Why are you guys bouncing? No need for all that. Easy, easy, easy. Go ahead and take this off. Put it back where it needs to go. And then, yeah. This makes me happy. <laughs> this makes me super excited. All right. 
All right, guys. Well, this episode's kind of running long. I had some fun with the the, the trailers here and the uh, the rover and the truck and all this good stuff. So um, I think next episode we're going to expand on this a bit more. We are going to go out and find some more stuff to get into and see what the world has to offer. So I uh, hope you guys are enjoying this. I know I am. As always, thanks for watching. Take care. <laughs>